I'm Alan Sears. I teach in the Faculty of Education at the University of New Brunswick. Principally, I work in, in social studies education. Uh, I focus my own academic work on civics and citizenship education, but I also have an interest in history education uh, at the graduate level. I also work on teaching and research methods and educational policy. I teach undergraduate methods courses, teaching methods courses in social studies for both elementary and secondary students. Uh, developed a new course a couple of years ago on teaching in international contexts, which focuses on uh, students who want to teach overseas, either in international schools or in national schools in various countries. And at the graduate level, uh, for a number of years, I've taught research methods and uh, a course that's called Current Issues in Curriculum and Instruction. Uh, I'm involved in three research projects right now, uh, two related to civics and citizenship education. One is uh, looking at how grade 12 students in Atlantic Canada and the West understand democratic participation. And the other is looking at how teachers and students understand ethnic diversity in different parts of Canada. And the third project is uh, one I'm doing with colleagues here in the faculty that's uh, uh, trying to map the landscape of teacher education in Canada. So we're trying to look at the various approaches universities have to educating teachers. I regularly supervise masters and PhD students. Uh, I have uh, just finished a master's student who wrote a, a report on teaching about religion in schools. Uh, another master's student recently finished a thesis on environmental education in, uh, in grade 10 classrooms in New Brunswick. And I have a PhD student now working on uh, the, the teaching and learning of history in museum settings. I also do a lot of work in schools uh, with teachers, uh, a lot lately on a project called the Historical Thinking Project, so helping teachers uh, focus on uh, helping kids learn history in more engaging and interactive ways.